it's your girl Peta Gay here. Before we get into today's video, I do want to tell you guys about Bright Cellars. I love a nice glass of wine, especially on stressful mommy days. I am super happy to have found Bright Cellars on a fellow YouTuber channel. So once I checked them out, I was super grateful to Bright Cellars for having me as a part of their ambassador program. Bright Cellars is a subscription-based wine company that delivers excellent wine to their members, creating matches you will love. Once you go on their website, you will take their quiz, which helps in creating your taste profile. They ask questions like what type of chocolate you can eat for the rest of your life, and a few of their answers they have are dark chocolate, white chocolate and then for people who are not interested in chocolate where is a fruity candy then they also ask you how you like your tea hot with sugar brewed strong or no tea no tea i absolutely love their packaging you can tell they put a lot of pride in it plus who wants to get broken wine bottles at their front door in my package i receive seven bottles of wine they come with wine cards that tells you about the wine and the foods you can pair them with. Because it is a subscription base, you can get the option to skip monthly or cancel anytime you choose. My husband was a big fan of the wines as they were mostly on the dry side, which for me, I mostly prefer sweet. After you get your wine and try them, you're able to go on their website and rate the wines. If I'm being honest, the wines they got me are not wines I would choose for myself because of how dry they were. The only two I would try again are the white ones. They weren't sweet and they weren't dry. They were in between, but I was able to enjoy it just because it wasn't extremely dry. I did let my husband judge the dry ones based on someone who loves dry wine. Let's just say, seven bottles of wine did not last for three weeks. Would I try them again? Absolutely yes. I'm actually planning to get quite a few for my mom upcoming 68th birthday party. I don't know anything about wines, I just know I love a good wine. So I was definitely excited for this box because it coming with cards, you're able to learn about different wines, where they are from, how you can pair them and I like that because I like learning new things about things that I enjoy so learning about wines was definitely something fun so that's one of the great things about Bright Cellars is that you are learning while enjoying a lovely glass of wine. Today I will be pampering myself and having Bright Cellars wine picks will go perfectly with my mommy time. If you want to find out more about Bright Cellars, I will link their info down below so you can sign up. Using my link, you will get a $45 credit. That's three bottles towards your first shipment. As a disclaimer guys, I would never tell you to try something if I've never tried it myself. I hope you guys enjoyed this portion of the video as well as try out Bright Cellars. I will link their information below so you guys can go and check them out. Hey everyone, I hope you had a lovely day. Today I'm sharing with you my mommy time pamper day routine. I have three little ones, all under five, the youngest being eight months. I love my kids, but being a mom can be overwhelming. I'm always on the go, also dealing with exhaustion from a newborn and fatigue. Finding time for me helps with my sanity and letting me know it's okay to put me first. Mom guilt can make us feel it's wrong to put ourselves before our kids, but I'm here to tell you it's perfectly okay. Our kids want us at 100% and it's hard to do that when we constantly neglect our needs. Always remember, 
it's okay to put yourself first. As I get my self-care started, I wanted to enjoy my favorite type of tea. Well, one of my favorite. I read on Google that chamomile tea is good for reducing anxiety as well as helping with sleeping and calming an upset stomach. My goal for this video is to help you guys not only focus on the pampering, but to also appreciate a peaceful and relaxing environment. It's important to declutter your mind, creating a peaceful space. I know I was going to be in my room, in Journey's room, and the bathroom, so I made sure to clean those rooms to help create that peaceful atmosphere. Even though I am no longer pregnant, I still take my prenatal vitamins every day. Prenatal vitamins are good to take before, during, and after pregnancy to help promote overall wellness. I usually take my vitamins with my Maya Organic Ear Vitamins, but I was out. To start my self-care, I am gonna focus on my nails. The day before, I went to Walmart and purchased the nails I wanted to use, as well as going to the nail salon to get a pedicure. For most of my life, I've always had an issue with biting my nails, and lately I have been focusing on trying to grow them. One way that I grow my nails with no problem is whenever I put on false nails. Usually I go to the nail salon and do a full set, but I really didn't want to do that this time. But y'all, I had no clue what I was doing. I didn't even know if I was using these tools correctly. And honestly, I did not feel like reading the instructions. So I pretty much just did what I could and assume that I was doing it right. like how easy these nails are to put on as well as how easy they are to take off even though i love going to the nail salon and love somebody else doing my nails i feel like this method is so much more affordable and if you feel like like myself sometimes i just cannot afford to go get my nails done this is such an easy way to get that fixed Now that my nails are done, I'm going to go into Journey's room and just relax, have something to eat, and watch one of my favorite shows, which is Bones. I've watched this show several times. Every year, I've watched it at least once, binge watch all 12 seasons. I absolutely love watching Bones, and every time I watch it, it's like I'm watching it for the first time. later now that it's a couple hours later and i've taken care of my mind now it's time to pamper my body and before that i'm gonna enjoy me a nice glass of wine from bright sellers remember guys check out bright sellers the link will be below so i'm sharing with you all the items that i will be using to pamper my face and my body today a lot of these items i got from walmart as well as amazon and then i had my myel organic face rub
set the mood, I'm going to set up my diffuser and I'm going to add my peppermint and lavender oil to it as well as lit my candle that I got from Walmart. I am not sure if I got this face steamer from Walmart or Amazon, but I will check my purchase history and see if I find it in either. So to set the mood, I always love listening to some music. So I'm definitely going to listen to some slow jams on my Pandora. You just kind of have a self-care pamper moment without some music to vibe to. I bought this marble peel-off face mask from Walmart and it felt so good rubbing it on my face and now I'm just gonna let it sit while I steam my pores. Using a steamer open blockage and loosen up oils, dirt, blackhead and allow your products to penetrate into your pores. It feels so good on my face. It wasn't hot. It really felt good. I will say, if you don't have a steamer, you don't have to buy one. All you can do, which is a simple method, get a pot, put some water in it, boil it real hot, get a towel, put your face over the steam, and cover your face, and there you go. You have an at-home easy steamer. But I really wanted a professional one, so I went online and got me one. To be honest, guys, I really don't know my face type. And when I say face type, I mean, you know how some people have dry skin and some people have oily skin. I honestly don't know if I have dry skin or... As far as my face is concerned, I don't know if it's oily or dry. I could not tell you if it is. Now I'm going to use my charcoal cleanser and this feels so good on my face. I actually got this from Walmart. I've been using it for years now and every time I use it after I do my facial, it always feels so good so after i use this and i wash it off my face i am gonna use my maya organic i've been using maya organic products for a very long time now i absolutely love all the hair products so why would i not add the facial products to my line of things that i like to use so guilty of this when i used to do my facials i used to do my face and i would never do my neck and i've watched so many self-care videos and i hear them always talking about when you're doing your face routine definitely do your neck as well i usually use my facial brushes as a part of my routine but being a mom, anything I have, I guess it belongs to my kids as well because my youngest, Jeremiah, used to play with it as a toy until he broke it. So once he broke it, I just gave him all the brushes so he could have the full set to play with. using razors so or a female razors anyway so i actually got myself one of these electronic razors that men use for myself to shave with 
I don't do wax. I'm scared to do wax. I feel like it's going to hurt real bad. So I'll just stick to the shaving. And this does a pretty good job. I will be taking a bubble bath. But before I do so, I like to take a shower first. Because really... Who wants to sit in their filth in the bathtub? I don't shower in really hot water. My water have to be lukewarm. But whenever I'm taking a bubble bath, I like my water to be hot because then I'm able to spend a longer time in the tub. Once I am finished taking a shower, I'm gonna get my bath ready for the relaxing part of my self-care. I will be adding in some oil, some bath salt and you cannot have a bubble bath without the bubbles i'm also going to be adding all the necessities i need while i'm in the bath so i'm going to have my candle i'm going to have me a glass of wine i'm dripping my oil for that scented relaxation that i needed and this oil is a peppermint scent and add my daily wisdom motivational book for women and then once i have finished taking my bubble bath i'm just gonna clean my ears y'all you need to clean your ears so you can hear me well <laughs> so this CeraVe is really for my son because he has really dry skin but I love using it on my face whenever I do a at home facial <laughs> This face mist that I will be using, I got it from Walmart when I did a Walmart pickup. They were giving away a few goodies and one of the goodies in the bag was this facial mist. So it definitely came in handy because I thought I had a facial mist but mine was finished thanks to my little toddler. So now I'm in my room and I am gonna brush my teeth and get myself ready for the night i'm not going to bed just yet because i am not an early sleeper so once i finish brushing my teeth i'm gonna oil my legs lotion my legs so i always put lotion and oil on my legs even though i don't know if i have dry skin but i feel like i do so i love to use baby oil to give that extra shine
if I have dry skin but y'all I do know I have dry lips <laughs> my lips are always dry so I'm always making sure I moisturize now y'all I probably think I was on TikTok doing all of this <laughs> but I felt like it came out so cute my mom got me this body spray. I'm not sure where she got it from, but it smells so good. So I'm ending the night smelling divine. And then I'm going to go back into Journey's room, chill with her, watch some TV, and eat dinner, which is pizza. I know I'm trying to lose my baby weight, but y'all, I cannot help when it comes to pizza. But guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you got some motivation to go pamper yourself. Whether it's just a facial at home or you go to the nail salon to get your nails done. Whatever makes you feel 100%, take that time and take care of you. Remember, as moms, we are focused on our kids that we sometimes neglect herself. So make sure you take the time to put you first because you matter. Again, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I cannot wait to make another self-care routine video for you guys because I definitely enjoy making this one. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.